Hello and welcome to this video about changing the hammer on the CC75. This is a CC75B but it goes for all the CC75 models. First of all, of course we check that the chamber is empty. The magazine is empty, this is not the proper magazine for this but okay. And then we take down, take off the slide. Line up the notch back here and just press in this pin and it will go off. Now we, what we're going to do is to, to change the hammer. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is to take off the grips. Just use a normal screwdriver. Uh, and the hammer goes up here. So we need to take out this. This is under a lot of pressure, so you need to push it in while you take out this pin here. The pin is out. And as I said, now it's under a lot of pressure, so be careful when you pull this out. There it comes. Could be a bit hard to get out, but uh, there it is. Right, then the spring comes out. Okay, now we need to get out the safety and to do that you need to lift the little spring here. So now you can see that lies beside where it should be. And then you can use a punch to get out this pin here. And then the safety should come out. Okay, just push the circuit forward and it will come out. Okay, now you need to remember this the spring loaded piece here. Be careful when you take it out because there is a spring as I said. So it could... there. When it goes back in remember that this is the side up. This should be turned up. Now you can push this up this pin, it will fall out, there, and then this can also be pushed out. And there you have your hammer. Right, so this is the competition hammer. Uh, what we also have is the original hammer. So this is the original hammer and this is the competition hammer and I can show you the difference. First of all this is a um, single action only hammer so you don't have the disconnector. This is the disconnector for double action. This is single action only. But the, all the difference is in the the groove here. You can see that. Here you can see it. This is the groove that the sear gets the hang of. You can barely see it. It's so thin. Whereas this, it got all this edge where the sear needs to pull off. I, I will show you with the sear. 
the difference. So this is the original hammer. And this is the sear. So originally it will be like this when you cock the hammer. And when you pull the trigger, you need to pull and pull and pull and pull and there it goes. It fires. But you see it's a lot of travel here. And this makes the trigger travel quite long. Whereas the new improved um, competition hammer from CC, you see that there's not much hang of that, so uh, it barely touches or grips the sear. So you pull the trigger and it goes right off. So that is the difference in trigger pull. You need to decide if you are going to have a single action, double action gun or you want to turn it into a single action only. If you want it to be a single action only uh, gun, you remove the disconnect or you just don't take it on the new hammer. You don't move it. If you want to do it a uh, single action only, the only thing you do need to do is to take off this pin and remove this spring rod and move it to the new hammer. That's everything. So now you have uh, a new hammer and we want to insert it again. Align the hammer. Get this pin here. It's going this way. There. Secure it with the little pin here. All right. Remember this. This is up. Now the sear cage. You don't need to do anything with the sear cage. There's some spring tension here. Hold it in position. Now you take the safety lever, move it in, make sure the spring is away from it. And to get it all the way in, you need to take, grab off this and pull it back and it will go right in. Make sure the spring here falls back in place. in the groove. Now the safety is alright. Okay, now for the spring here. There. Remember the tension here. Could be a good idea to press it into a The surface or with your hand and replace replace the pin. There we have it and you can check that it works. Yeah it does. So for the grips Groups in place and just line up this these notches and um, 
and if you can see the reset here it's very very short Thank you for watching.